another question I get asked all the time and I'd like to hear what Dr. Drew Taylor has to say. We hear that stem cells is a treatment, it's arriving, and I know that stem cells from plants can happen and for a period of time in some countries, you can use somebody else's stem cells. And so now you're saying you can now take stem cells from hair follicles and grow them into certain lines to get you treatments that are from your own stem cells. Is that true? And what's the difference? Well, the stem cells in your hair follicle actually come from multiple different lineages. You've got keratinocytes, which is like the surface layer of your skin, fibroblasts, the deeper layers of your skin, and you have mesenchymal stem cells or mesenchymal stem cells that are, are really part of our connective tissue. They form bone, cartilage, fat, and then you also have these hair follicle specific stem cells. When we look at cord blood, uh, traditionally it's been hematopoietic stem cells that we were harvesting. These are blood stem cells. Now since then we really learned a lot about the value of mesenchymal or mesenchymal stem cells and those stem cells uh, are present but you have to work a little bit harder to get them from cord blood. They're actually located in the tissue or an area called the warden's jelly and so techniques have changed over time where those cells are now focused on from cord blood but ultimately mesenchymal stem cells is really what you want to be harvesting. You can get them from cord blood. Um, traditionally that wasn't done hair follicle cells, that's what you are going for.